All right, welcome to Muskrat Gulch. Um, today's video isn't from Muskrat Gulch, it's from one of our viewers. So why don't you come on back and watch with us? All right, today's video was not done at Muskrat Gulch. This was done by one of our viewers at their own home and he sent me the clips, I put them together and this is what you're gonna see. Now, Jim is not the kind of guy that wants to sit around doing nothing. He's gotta have something to do all the time. He's retired, but he doesn't like being retired. So he's always got something to do. And he started a new hobby a while ago and he wants to share it with us. So if you look right here, he made this for us and that's what he's gonna show us today. So um, Jim, take away. Uh, wood burning I've started doing. I'm not uh, that good at it yet. I'm just starting into it. Uh, this one here, is a box I got at dollar store and I just uh, put some birds on the front of it and an owl and a few other birds all the way around it and uh, yeah it's uh, very interesting I'm enjoying it it's a nice little hobby and uh, the wolves is my favorite ones to do I got a couple of them and I've just done this one here, Muskrat Gulch, that is uh, on YouTube. If you uh, watch it, you'll be able to, uh, to, uh, to see it on there. It's uh, very interesting, and these other ones might be on there. I know you can't make no promises. That's up to Rick. Anyway, I'm just starting to do a pattern out here, uh, and what I've done was I've got it partially on my board using a, wa a meat wrapping wax paper I've traced it uh, onto there with my printer and then I just put it upside down on here and rub it down now there's a lot of spots missing but I'll fill them in, in as I go with the wood burning so uh, we'll uh, get back to you when I get started on some wood burning this is uh, one of the tips I use for wood burning. This is uh, like a spoon shape. It co covers in the darker spots like this here, one down in here you're working on. And the other tip is a, is a fine tip that I like to use to use for uh, doing the small lines and, and, and stuff like in the cabin here and stuff. And there's, there's several uh, different types of tips I got with it is some a whole uh, a whole pile of them and uh, they're all different I haven't got to use uh, most of them yet but I'm working on it and uh, as like I say I'm just starting on this so I'm gonna start doing some wood wood burning and I'll be wearing a mask so I'll uh, halfway through I'll turn it back on and show you where I'm at with it so uh, thank you this this one here, I made and uh, used uh, Mod, Mod Podge on it, and uh, I tried to see how it would work as a trivet, and it's not bad. It's, we've had it, uh, uh, hot stuff on it a few times, and it's put a few marks on it, and that, and a lot of them will do as a, as a wall hanger, too, but uh, this is as far as I've got so far with it. Uh, I'm going to finish putting in the dark spots with the spoon shaped one which I'm waiting for my iron to cool down so I can switch out then I'll take and give it a light sanding all the way over the whole thing wipe it all down with a rag then I'll take Mod Podge and put a coat on it let it sit for approximately two to three hours then I'll give it another light sanding and do another coat of Mod Podge. And uh, this one here, I imagine I'll be keeping myself because I got the cabin a little too close to the lake. But it, I, I'm enjoying it. I don't like working with the pine because it makes it blotchy pine, different spots it runs into and it, and it uh, burns it a little too far. Uh, these ones here were plywood birch 
and uh, it's really nice to work with this stuff. But at the price of wood right now, uh, half a sheet of this was uh, $65. Uh, and the pine, I got eight pieces like this was probably $8 or something. But like I say, it doesn't do as nice a job. But I'll get it sanded down and touched up and, and we'll see how it turns out. So that's what we want. Um, we're not asking for, for a, a movie from you. We want you to get us a clip or two or photographs and we'll stitch them together. Jim sent me, I think, four or five videos and uh, short ones and I put them together to make that video. Um, so that's what we want to hear from you. We want to see, this can't be just about Muskrat Gulch or, or Kelly. It, it's got to be you guys. So send us what you got. We'll get it up there and, and, uh, people will enjoy it. I promise. Um, so Jim, thank you very much. Um, appreciate it. We're going to take a look at some of your other hobbies eventually and, and, uh, We'll get at it. Thank you very much for joining us. Remember, Women That Hunt every second Tuesday, Muskrat Gulch every Thursday. Um, I hope we have something that you enjoy. Thank you very, very much. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.